the first candle I got, it's because I got candles, is this amazing, amazing candle. It's amazing. I just can't even, I, I'm, I'm a bakery scent girl. Let me, let me start out by saying like, I'm a bakery scent girl, even though I didn't really get bakery scents tonight or last night, which was hysterical, but I'm a bakery scent girl all the way. Food scents are good too, but mostly just bakery scents. But I could not help to like, I just love this. So I walked in, I walked in. And this is the first thing I saw, and I was like, that's interesting. So I sniffed it. It's called Linen Culling Tea and Lemon. They had, like, a bunch of cities and stuff. And I was like, this is a cool line. But, like, sir, for cereal. This smells like iced tea. Like, it's not, I'm not even kidding you with how much this smells like iced tea. It's, like, it's out of this world. Like, whoever made this and picked the oils and however they sent candles did phenomenal job i want to give them a hug because this is such a good candle it's not even funny i haven't burned it yet so i don't know how it burns or anything that's why i didn't buy like more of them because it was the eight dollar candle sale um and i was pumped i was like in chem class let me tell you the story of this i was in chem class and i was about to fall asleep and i was like oh my god this is horrible and so i was scrolling scrolling uber facts talking about like octopuses and penises as always and, and i was keep, kept on scrolling and people were just bitches were complaining and whatnot but anyway i'm sorry if i swear on this channel like do you guys not like me to swear on this channel but anyway so um and then i came across like the eight dollar candle sale notification on twitter and i was like oh my god i can't believe because we were going to the mall tonight anyway so it was, it was like over the moon over the moon so pumped so i could have gotten another one for a low a low low price but I just didn't know how it burned and I didn't want to, you know, spend extra, extra money on something that I just didn't know how it burned well. But I'm going after Christmas. Um, hopefully we have after Christmas sales. I'm not sure if they do. But anyway, if they do, definitely going to get this if it burns well and I like it. And I've never had a problem with Bath & Body Works candles burning, really. I mean, it's fine, whatever. But anyway, definitely want to smell. Smell. If Even if you don't like it, just smell it. You'll be amazed. I swear. Anyway, the second one I bought, it's another, it's another like, drink one. It's the Cranberry Pear Bellini. It actually burned this one today. This is actually the first one that burned kind of funky. Look at it. Do you see it? How it's slanted? Isn't that weird? I burned it on a flat surface, but whatever. <laughs> I burned it today in my, not in my bath, but on the counter <laughs> when I, while I was taking my bath. And uh, This is, smells delicious. My mom gave me a little like mini tiny one. Um, when she went Black Friday shopping, she brought it home. She's like, look what I got you. And I was like, oh, it's an early Christmas present. So I hope she can get me the big one or like another one of these that I bought. But what? I'm always open for more candles, even if they're the same ones. If I like it enough, I want a new one. But anyway, I am so odd. I am so weird. But, um, so I just, this is delicious. I love it. It smells like fruits and ish and it's bubbly and delicious. Bright blend of sparkling cranberry, sweet pear, nectar, and luscious blackcurrant. Everything's blackcurrant. This is blackcurrant, this is black. I just, I don't, I don't even know what a blackcurrant is. So I just, it just smells like fruits and deliciousness. And that's what it smells like. Like this one. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, so anyway. Um, Next one I got is kind of controversial because my mom is allergic to vanilla. Um, but this one, I think, this one has vanilla in the name of it. But um, it seems like it's one of the, the under notes, not like the top notes, which is funny. But um, it doesn't smell like it either. I, I get it's juniper, um, caramel, and sandalwood. And I get the juniper and the sandalwood. And I'll tell you a story about the sandalwood. The sandalwood is one of my boyfriend's like signature scents kind of sort of not really he loves sandalwood so much and he has like the sandalwood artist shaving kit thing that i actually got for his birthday and um this kind of candle just reminds me of me and him because i love the smell of juniper and i love the smell of like vanilla and he loves the smell of sandalwood so i feel like just smelling this reminds me of him and reminds me of us and especially since he's at college this year and i've been really been missing him a lot that I just feel like I want something to kind of cozy up with. And I love, I love the scent of this. And this will just make me like think of him, you know? <laughs> and um, I don't know, unfortunately I might not be able to burn it just because I don't want to kill my mom, but I kind of have to make that decision before I start burning it because I could always give it to my boyfriend's mom. 
um, for Christmas, so I'm not sure about that yet. The candle that I bought in mind for her, and that he said that she would have liked, is this one. And it is the Frosted Cranberry one. It smells absolutely delicious. She's like one of those women that like, she loves the fresh scents, the no-name scents, and she loves bakeries. She's like, loves every single scent. So I really don't think that she'll mind the sandalwood vanilla, but um, he said that she'll really like this if I end up giving it to her. Anyway, but I've been smelling this so much lately and I just want this. I want this candle. I just, I want it. <sighs> this is just such a sexy candle. Florida Forest like loves this candle and I just feel like I want to be in the club but um it's an amazing candle it's cranberry but it's something else I don't even know what it is deep red cranberries of winter shine in this fragrant blend of pink currant pink what is that all these currants vanilla and red apple I get kind of the red apple a little no I don't really get the vanilla it just smells like a very fresh cranberry like you just like like a very cold cranberry with apples if that's what, like a very, like a chilled apple cranberry sound. It's, it's very good. But I'm not sure if I want to give that one away yet. Or if I want to give Sandalwood away. Or if I give them both away and just have everybody be happy. So the next thing I got from my boyfriend's mom in mind is this. So she can put whatever candle that I decide to give her into this. And if it's Sandalwood, then it'll look all pretty with the gold and gold on. Maybe that's cute. Maybe I should give her this one. Or maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. But, um... Yeah, so it's just a really pretty um, case for candles. And you can use it all year round, not all year round, but you can use it all winter round um, just because it has a snowflake and it doesn't have like Christmas shenanigans. So I like it. It matches a lot of things because gold's my personal favorite um, metal. But um, I think it's really sophisticated and pretty. And yeah, so I got this for her. And so that was my haul. Yeah, so <laughs> that was my haul um, of Lush and Bath and Body Works, and I hope you guys liked it. So, comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll be back, guys. And tell me if you want a tutorial for this look, because I just kind of came up with this look today, and it's kind of Christmassy in a way. I don't know. I was thinking it. I was. I made this up with you guys in mind. So if you like to see this as a video, I just. I didn't know. I, I didn't have. <laughs> I did not have enough time to film this video, but um, if you'd like to see this, then please tell me. Um, I would love to recreate this for you guys, so yeah. Goodbye! Have a good week slash end of the week, uh, whenever I put this up, or beginning of the week, yeah. Bye. <laughs>